Men, we're moving out. I meant to ask you something earlier. I might have an answer. How do you survive the invasion? I almost didn't. A peasant pulled me from the battlefield. She nursed me back to health. <laughs> you always were lucky. How did you and your men escape? We ran. Do what you need to prepare. I'll see you at the old cemetery. Never surrender. Not to anyone. Yuzo should be in the cemetery. How long's it been since Shinzo left? Long enough to scout the fort. Should be back any moment. Good. You're here. You ready to steal some food for us? <sighs> the 
Is this everyone? Just the men who can fight worth the damn. The rest are too hungry or sick. Let's hope we're enough to raid the fort. There's a better chance of seeing cherry blossoms in winter than getting that food. There's always a way. Preferably one that doesn't kill half my men. Scout's back. Come on. A lot of men inside, and a signal at the top of the tower. If they call reinforcements from the bay, we'll be trapped. They'll cut us to pieces. Find a place to watch for me. Once I destroy their signal, attack. They'll kill you. If they do, avenge me, and take their food. That's not funny. Watch the tower for my signal. If you say so. signal the others. They'll see me light the brazier. It's time, Yuzo.
That's the last of them. Look around. Did you find anything? Nothing here. Nothing over here. Let's get your men something to eat. Where's all the food? I didn't see any in the tower. Did you find anything? Just a stack of Mongol papers on a dead officer. Let me see. Do you read Mongolian? If it's in Chinese, I can make out some of it. Since when? Since I had to read Sun Tzu. This was only a temporary depot. Taking everything. Offshore. The boats are in the bay. We'll never get out to them. You got in here. You're crazy. What did you have in mind? Let's see what we're up against. Mongols have small boats on the beach. We could steal one, but we'd have to cut through their army. Too many barriers and archers. A frontal attack would be suicide. I want my men far away from the enemy's line. Put your archers on that cliff. The Mongols will focus on them while we steal a boat. Flaming arrow might set off those explosives. That will get their attention. But we need them to look away from the beach. All right, men. They don't know we took the fort, so they'll be waiting for reinforcements that aren't coming. Keep them busy long enough for us to steal a boat. Then retreat into the forest. Look for my torch. That's your signal to attack. Let's find a way down to the beach. You heard, Yuzo. That's we won't let you down. Watching you fight back there reminded me of Lord Nagao's tournaments. You did whatever it took to win. It was a competition. You fought just as hard. Did I? What are you getting at? Nothing. Just remembering our duel. We'll talk about this later. If we survive. should be in position. Light the torch. Now, man. I knew they'd come through. Look at that fire. I knew they'd come through. Look at that fire.
We need to move quickly. Take an oar. Can't believe no one saw us. Too busy watching the fire. We're going quietly. I never knew our duel bothered you so much. Now you do. No luck. You should have told me earlier. Life took us in different directions. Anyway, it was a long time ago. No food here. Any sign of food? Not here. Maybe on the next ship. After that, sounds like four or five guys. No way around. Surprise them. Greetings! Nice ship. We have to move fast. More Mongols. Take them. Isn't here. It has to be on the other ship. You search here. I'll take the other. Be careful.
These look like battle plans. Better go find a result. Inside of any food, there has to be something. I would have heard that Mongo if you hadn't shown him. I know. Did you see how big he was? That's where all our food went. <laughs> Rizzo, we have to go. Can we swim? I have to. My arm's ready. Jump! Let's get out of sight. They're still hunting us. There's a good hiding spot ahead. I promised my men I'd feed them, and I'm going back empty-handed. We'll find another way. But how many will I lose before then? I found something that might help. Mongol battle plans. Do they show supply lines? One page has a map. It's a start. Hand it over. We do this together. You've got your own problems, and I am the leader. I need this, Jin. And I'll need you at Castle Canada. You'll have me. Don't let them see you coming. Just like you. I need to find Yuna. We're in this together.
Some weapons. What's the point? Mongols won. The samurai are dead. Do you want to sit around waiting to be killed? I once spent an entire year following the loot play around and hearing. How is your armor fitting, my lord? Certed to frustrate your enemies. This will keep you safe. Thank you. Bodies left rotting on stakes. We pray for your safety. Master Sora!
Quickly, Sora! Calm down. Who's been taken? The invaders took our house. Down the road. My wife is there. With my son. You left your family behind? What choice did I have? I'm no warrior. <sighs> I'll help them. Stay here. No sign of the family here. Maybe outside. Laundry. Still damp. The attack was sudden. A lot of blood. Someone was killed here. Bodies were dragged, thrown in the water. A child's toy. His family didn't survive. I should let him know. Lord, did you find them? Hmm. Your family was killed. I'm sorry. Why didn't you save them? I ran like a coward. I should be dead too. It's not your fault. Don't let their deaths be in vain. Resist the invaders. Help those in need. Yes, my lord.
Susano, protect me. Dead bodies. Who killed these people? A fearsome warrior. He demanded I tell him the tale of Shigenori's heavenly strike. When he didn't hear the answers he sought, he flew into a rage and butchered them. What did he want to know? I'm not sure, my lord. Tell me the story. I need to know what he's after. When Tsushima was first settled, a strange and terrible thunderstorm swept across our island. Wherever lightning struck, beasts of lightning appeared. These violent creatures tore through villages, causing death and destruction moving too quickly to be stopped. The people knew only one man who could possibly stand against the lightning beasts. Shigenori, the fastest swordsman in all of Tsushima. Shigenori never lost a duel. With years of practice, he had created the Heavenly Strike, an attack that struck quicker than the eye could follow. Shigenori, lured the creatures to a desolate beach in Komatsu, where the sand would slow their movement. Their clash turned the sand to ash and bleached the leaves of trees white. Shigenori's heavenly strike cut through them faster than they could move. As the final beast fell, the storm cleared and Tsushima was safe again. Shigenori began a life of seclusion. Few students found him, and only the bravest and most skilled proved worthy of learning the heavenly strike. When a storm approaches, a sword is placed at Shigenori's rest by a student who knows of its location to ward off attacks from beasts of nature. The murderer wishes to learn Shigenori's heavenly strike. It sounds dangerous in the wrong hands. Which way did he go? A woman fled toward a nearby bridge. He chased her. He'll answer for what he did here. That's the bridge the musician mentioned. Someone weeping. Where? My lord, so many slaughtered. Did you see the man who killed them? I know who he is. Yasuhira Koga. I've heard the name. He fought for the Yarikawa clan. 
Would you recognize him? I'll never forget that leering face. Follow me. Perhaps I can pick up his trail on the other side of the bridge. Horse tracks. Yasuhiro was in a hurry. What more do you know of Yasuhiro Koga? Only that he was a retainer for the Yarikawa clan years ago. After the rebellion was crushed, the clan was dissolved and retainers dismissed. Rumor says he left Tsushima, but when the Mongols attacked, he returned. From where, I'm not sure. It doesn't matter. He cannot be allowed to live after what he's done. Up ahead, they're constructing a roadblock. Mongols, hide yourself. I said your best warrior. Captain <laughs> Salakat. <laughs> See Yasuhira Koga anywhere. We're pursuing a man named Yasuhira Koga. He just left. He's been staying in the watchtower. Working with the Mongols? Yes. But last night they argued. Only made out one word. Chigenori. I'll search the watchtower. Find somewhere safe before more Mongols come. What has Yasuhira been doing? A dueling ring. He's looking for it. White leaves. 
like those bleached by lightning in the tail. The Mongols have their own version of Shigenori's tail. Maybe he wanted to compare it to the musician's version. Yasuhira is looking for someone who can teach him Shigenori's heavenly strike. The white leaves. There are trees like that not far from here. That's where he went. You've helped enough. Get to safety with the others. Thank you, my lord. I hope you punish that monster. Need to find white-leafed trees. So... 